Good evening, and welcome back to Timberborn, where we've had a change of plan. Yes, 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 I'm no longer building the dams, or the levees, all the way along the edge here to seal the water in. Um, we could do it, it would work. We'd have to then turn on and off our, our grabbers here to do things, and so, uh, yeah, so um, let's start that up there. In fact, what we're going to do is I'm going to pause with these guys. See, I've built a few of them here. Just, just, just a few. Just just a few, you know. Um, because I want to get this scrap done. Because I want to get it out of the way really, really quickly. So that we can um, uh, have the channel free and not worry about it. However, however um, Phantom Man in the comments uh, to the uh, previous episode mentioned that it might make more sense to just blow a channel out this way and have the, the water just come out this way we could also do it here as well we, we could blow a channel out here and just have the uh, the bad water to turn around and go away like for the time being and then that leaves us the whole map to play with to do things um so yeah yeah I, I, we need to get rid of these trees which means we need to get more uh wood storage going which is not a problem let's pause these two again and let the trees grow there and do that that should be fine um uh, but we need explosives, so let's get explosives, shall we? So this is 400, we have 220 science, so we need more science. So we're going to wait a few days for that, that's not a problem. But we do have extract. We have extract now. You're producing uh, one extract every 0.75 hours, and you want one every three hours. Uh, 7.5, uh, one and a half, three. So you make four... Oh, actually, no, you need bad water. You don't extract, you need bad water. Uh, yes, 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 not extract. Extract is for putting explosives down. Um, so we're going to get two here. Produce three an hour, six an hour, um, and you will want five every three hours. So plenty, plenty. We've also got this one here. I'm just using just to pump this dry, just to get it out of the way and not waste it, basically. So, so um, okay. Let's uh, speed up this here and get things in here. I am building a really tall tower for scrap. I'm now going to change this up as well. Um, we'll go, we'll go too high here. We don't we don't need to go as high for the scrap now because I don't need to get this out as quickly if we change the plan. It's not it's not huge like we must grab 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 go 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 go. Um it's um it, it doesn't have to come in as quickly, so so that's gonna be the plan. We will I don't know if I want to blow it out of here or if I do want to do this here. If we get rid of these trees, I would happily do it here. We we just take out like a section here, put in some levees here, and have the the and then seal this off here and then bad tide to bump 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 and come out that way. I think that'll work. I think that'll work. Yeah. Yeah. Yep. Yeah, I think that would work. Okay. So we need to put in some some things here. So um I mean the closer I do it, the easier it's gonna become for us. And yeah, we built this here and it's a little bit of a waste, but it yeah, meh. It's, it's a fail safe. It's a fail safe. If this doesn't work, if this overflows for whatever reason, then that will seal off and push the water down here. But there shouldn't be as much water coming down here. So I think we'll be okay. We'll see. We'll see how it goes. Uh, we got a bad tide approaching anyway, so I can't do a great deal about it. Uh, these are no longer set to turn off on contamination because it's, it's just not working. So the bad tide is just going to flow down here anyway. But we're good. We're good anyway. We are getting enough water in almost. Things are a little bit slow. Oh. But I think we're okay. I think we're okay. Um, let us change something here as well. I want to turn off those three and those three. I want to put in two large tanks here. Two. Put three large tanks in there, actually. If we uh, say don't do anything there, we'll put three large tanks in there. Why not? Why not? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Cool, right, so that's what we'll do. Uh, you have nothing to chop down, that's fine. Chop down all of that, if you would, please. I just want to put one in here, just to get rid of these trees over here, as well. Oh, yeah, and then we'll get these trees done here. Let's also build another storage. And we've got three, let's go to five. Uh, also, um, uh, who was it? Who was it? Who was it? Um, 
Uh, Alex, Alex mentioned um, about the, uh, um, did I forget about the ladders? I assume you meant ladders, you said stairs. Forgot you installed the stairs again. Um, oh, do you mean here? I, I, I assume you meant, you meant, did I forget that we have ladders again? Um, uh, and I, I was using stairs in places because they're cheaper. That, that's the whole point, that was the whole reason for using the stairs. Stairs are cheaper than ladders, and uh, we don't, we're not struggling for resources, but... Um, Yeah, so, so you know, or, or did you mean here? I don't know. I don't know what you mean here. So, yeah. Um, yeah. Um, and uh, Mr. Morky pointed out that we haven't paused the pods yet. Um, but I don't think we need to now. Uh, I think I think we're good. I think we're good. We're getting... Hmm. Are we getting in? Food's going down a little bit. How many weavers do we really want? Let's be honest with you. So these are doing... Uh, we're still at... Yeah, we're at 20. Yeah, we're at 20. So these are doing 12... 24, 48. We've got five beavers spare, so I can't. I only really want to pause one of them, but I might pause two. In fact, what I want to do, um, I'm going to wait for them to be close to the end and pause them. Because uh, they're also, um, if, you, if you have some pods sat somewhere and you wait for them to go to the end, it doesn't necessarily work with the breeding pods. But if you get the um, the larger ones going, these ones, which use extract to, uh, to be, the beavers come out of here as adults they don't come out as kids they come out as adults um so uh if you have a breathing pod just a single advanced breathing pod somewhere wait for it to fill up almost full and pause it and just leave it even if something goes terribly wrong and your whole population dies you have that one beaver sat there who can just unpause he'll pop out in a day and one beaver is enough to restart your entire civilization you can rebuild from it, it takes a long time it takes a long time i've done it from two i'm pretty sure you can do it from one uh, especially if you've already got stuff built, if you've got like an infrastructure built, you can just then pause all the buildings, and just enable water, let them pump water for a while, or enable food, plant the food, enable water, pump water, that's fine, and you just wait for the, you wait, wait for, um, you know, if, if a bad tides or drought's coming, you just don't unpause it, you wait till you get right just before the, uh, the, um, the good tide starts, and then you unpause him, pop him out, grab some water, plant some crops, and, uh, and you're away, and, and you can be good, because that beaver can last, for so long particularly if you've got berries as well uh if you have berries that are, are growing um then you'll be good here uh oh yeah our berries died that's something as well that i didn't i didn't mention also but because there was bad water ended up in here this overflowed and bad water ended up in here the berries actually died so it, it contaminated the land and the berries all died here so um, we had we had problems with that so yeah, start from one beaver is isn't fun. It, it isn't fun. It takes a, it just takes a long time. Just it's just slow. But um, you can you can recover. You absolutely can recover. Let's put a second medical bed in because I have two injured beavers. Our contamination bay is running, doing its thing, which is quite nice. Awesome. Um, wait, wait for the day to go by and the pumps to stop, and then we'll pause the pumps because after a day, there's really no good water in there anymore. Um, we are now up to nine hundred and sixty science. They're really cooking. They're really, really cooking. Awesome. Um, let's get ourselves a explosive factory. And uh, let's put it here. Oop. Yes. And then we'll put a storage opposite side of it, which is going to be one of these storages. I'm going to do a big warehouse because we want explosives. We're going to want a lot of explosives to do things. So get the big one going there. That'll be cool. We'll chop down all these trees and get all stuff cleared out there. And then we can start. Finally, looking at terraforming a little bit of the map and changing some things up. Um, I do want to collect the, I mean, the wood. I'm not too fussed about. We could just destroy the wood. Uh, but obviously, I need to collect all the ruins. Uh, you can't destroy these. Um, I don't think. Uh, can you mark them for demolition? No. No. You used to be able to mark them for demolition to get rid of them. But now, uh, it's a long time ago, though. Long, long time ago. So, okay, uh, so we need to unpause you. And if we unpause this as well, we're going to need it there, but that's fine. Yeah, let's, let's add another beaver to that and unpause this as well. And I don't think you're going to produce enough power for both of them. No, that's fine. We could also run a power line up here and plug it in to assist this, because this this is... Yeah. Um, how's Gears doing? Planks. Planks aren't doing all that great. Gears aren't doing all that great. I think we're fine though. I think we're fine. We've still got four beavers doing nothing. We've got four beavers living, living rough as well. Um, 
Oh, do we have enough science to unlock the, uh, the tall housing? 600. We can, yes, we do. Yes, we do. Okay. Okay. Um, how about we do that? How do we do that? Pause. Pause for a moment. Let's unlock the large row houses. The large row houses are fantastic. So, this stores 10 beavers. And I'll 10 beavers to live in here. I keep saying stores, but this, this can support 10 beavers. This can support 8 beavers. However, this is this big. So, in the same footprint, you can get three of them, which is eight, 16, 24 in the same footprint. This one can support 16, it's a three by three, um, and you can put eight, 16, 24, and then a one on the back as well, and you've got one to hold spare. Um, so yeah, and the normal row house is better than that one, so it's 10, 20, 15 instead of 10. Um, and better than that one, ten, no, you fit 10, 20, 15, no, you, yeah, it's better, so yeah, the row houses are better than, than all of them. The large row houses are just awesome, they, they just, just the amount of beavers they can hold eight beavers um, in a footprint so we can go 8 16 24 32 uh, and we can support 64 beavers in a much smaller area here and then do stuff here so let's get rid of these houses here which means everyone's gonna be homeless oh no that's okay yeah they don't mind they don't mind and we'll go eight yes 16 24 32 64 beavers um, and then I can't put them this side because of how that's awkward. So put two more in there, and then I've kind of got I need to redo the roads. That's alright, we can redo the roads, that's fine. So there's six there's twenty-four. Uh, 64, 74, 84, 84 beavers if we left this as it was. So that would work. Um, because I kind of want to run a road along there just because I can. Right like there. Yeah. Okay, so let's do that. And then let's, uh, well, nothing's in there anything else to build. So let's, um, nope, nothing else to build yet. So that's fine. Let them build there. So you're running at 90% power. That's alright. That's fine. That's fine. That's absolutely fine. Yeah, don't worry about that. And the great thing about these row houses as well, um, they only require logs. They don't require any planks or anything like that. They just require logs, which is dead easy to make. So, yeah. Yeah. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Right, so, uh, can I... Can we set these two here to demand? Our... Uh, haulers will come and grab the water from here and put it up here and then we can destroy these and put new ones in nothing to do in range yep you're done okay cool oh i was going to put the, the blow out this area here and have the uh the stuff we've got sort of set up already to do it which we could do um but then i'd have to change it later on and blow something up here because i would have to do it so uh, so how about we figure out exactly what we're going to do with this how about we figure out exactly on there so so i want to do a aqueduct that is going to be 10 wide well eight wide so um i can't unlock these yet but it's going to be uh there one two three four five and there but it needs to be eight wide because we need to put the edges on the side of it and put permeable floor on the bottom of it as well so we need to put the edges in and, and so on and so forth so if we did that 10 wide um, they can build that, which is awesome. They have to get to the centre. They can build it from the edge, which is awesome. Um, we'd have to come in, and then in again. And I'm not sure whether I want to go. So I want to make the water so it flows inwards nicely, not make it really harsh. Uh, this will all be done with that with the land. So um, if we went two tiles or three tiles. No, three would be weird. We want two tiles. Um, can I can I get dirt yet? Um, it's a thousand times not dirt. So, um, so if we went right, um, if we went two tiles in, so the water would would go one two and then come in again and then go one two and come in again and then that's the channel. That's the channel. So then we can build whatever around this um, to have that. So it's going to be a little bit more infrastructure this way. It's going to be the land. So that means that this is going to be out that far. With. Um, and we could have the this side have the water dump whilst we're building things. So 
that means uh, I need to get more science so I can unlock the dirt. Even though we can't put dirt in because I'm not doing it, I'd like, I'd like to unlock the dirt so I can pan this. So one, two, so one, two comes in by one. One, two comes in by one there. And that's where the levees will start. So that's where the first levee will be there. How far away is that from the edge? It says one, two, three, four, five. So that would be one platform, wouldn't it? Yeah, so then the platforms would start there. So don't build that. Don't build that. We don't want to build that. So this is this is actually where we want to blow it up. This is where we want to blow it up. And then we put the platforms in. And then that's where the aqueduct starts. So, so we're only going to have land, land, and land, which means I need to take out four tiles. Is four tiles enough to get rid of the bad water? It narrows down to six down here. And it's still not. Um, yeah, not overloading. So I think four should be enough. And it's going to be too deep as well. So yeah, I think that should be all right. And we'll just go like here. Uh, we'll make it too deep. Um, make it one deep. That would work better. Yeah, if I make it one deep, it would work better. So we'll go back to here. So we go one, two, three, four. Then we just go one, two, three, four, five. Um, no, nope, um, five. And then we just take out a five area here, leaving one gap of, of uh, dirt there. One, two, three, four, five to there. So yeah, that'll work. That'll work. That'll work. We'll do that. We'll do that. But we'll do that. And then we'll put the sluices in here. I need to I need to put the metal blocks in there, really. But what I do, I want to put the blocks in there. So we might have to... Uh, So the reason I'm 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 in an R and oh yeah, I don't know what I'm doing here because um uh, I want to put the metal plates in so that we can build the platforms like evenly so I can build like one, two, three, four, four, all the way along to the edge of the map. The problem with that is I haven't actually counted from this side of the map backwards, because that's what I should do. I should count from this side of the map backwards, because I want this to pour off the edge of the map. So this wants to be on aqueduct up high. I don't want to go back by five every time and find out where the first plate would be. Because it might be here, it might be here, it might be there. I don't know. We might have to extend it. So, so we should do that instead. We should do that. Let's count them out. Now, I don't remember how big this map is, um, because then it would be easy to figure out. Do, but let's let's do it the old-fashioned way. Let's do it the old-fashioned way. So, so uh, um, I can't do it the old-fashioned way. I have to I have to actually build it. Let's let's come to here and let's do this. So one, two, three, four, five. Yep. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Do, 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 do. A lot further down there. Not a tall. That is. That is quite a tall. A tall edge to the map there. I realise that. Um, one, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Two, three, four, and five. Three, four, five. One, two, ah. Four, five. Two, four, five. It's kind of awkward. Two, three, four, five. Two, three, four, five. Two, three, four, five. Wow. I could have done this easier. Yeah. Okay, I could have done this because you, you can you can drag this out and the path path around and let to go a certain distance. Um, but the problem to that is that uh, if it goes up, down, left, right, because it's not completely flat, you're not always guaranteed to get the right size out of it. So, okay, so there we go. So there's the five all the way along. So one, two, three. Four, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five. 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 
uh, 25 times 5 is 100. And 1, 1, 2, 3, 1, 2, 3. This is 103. 25 times 5 is 125, you idiot. Uh, so this is 127 by 127 map, I think, is, is square. So it's 127 by 127. Cool. Okay. Okay. Um, so if we start the first one here, that means this needs to narrow much, much quicker. So I think we'll start the first one here instead. This this just makes more sense. So uh, the first block will go there and then this block of land will still become land okay. which means we can put sluices in here which is which is cool okay and we can narrow it down and do stuff like that so okay 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 there we go there we go i hope you enjoyed my counting to, to five uh 25 times um <laughs> oh uh we're on day three of that and we don't have any water because i was distracted that's fine it's fine it's fine um we can also get rid of these Put in the larger ones. Could we have the science for them? Yes, we do. One, yes, two, three. Um, I don't know why my plank factory was paused. Why did I pause the plank factory? Hmm. Hmm. I'm explain why this hasn't been built. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. We've got the houses. Uh, yep, no one's sleeping rough. That's fine. You're going to pump away and everyone's going to get a drink in there. That's fine. Not a problem. Shane still can't automate these, turn these on and off. Um, the automation mod for this uh, hasn't been updated to, on the Steam Workshop yet, so. But yeah. Okay, so we want to put in sluices here, but I don't want to put in. Uh, that's not sluices, these sluices. I don't want to put in. Um, so, one, two. I want to put it in there. Two, three, four, five, six. Eight, like that. Okay. Oop. And then on top of them, there's going to be levees like that. And that seals off there. And then we're going to fit in with dirt around this, and that will be the height of our thing. And then that's that's where the uh, the first metal plank goes. So the metal block will go there. And the next metal block will go there. One there, one there. And then they'll have levees down the side as well. But this will be probably a levee here actually as well. Um. I just want to have you open for the moment. So just everyone go open for the moment. Um, so let's put in uh, levees there and levees there. So that'll be levees. And this can all then be dirt. And this is this is fine. And we'll fill this up with dirt as well. This will flood over here. Not a problem. Um, so we need to get a thousand signs for dirt. We also need to get an excavator going uh, for dirt, uh, which requires extract to mine stuff. That's fine. Where do we put the excavator? Uh, anywhere doesn't really matter i could put it over here and plug into the back of this because this is not really having a heavy demand the expert uses 200 so not a terrible idea um, we get behind there uh we haven't really left ourselves any space to get behind there. didn't really think that one through this all does want to be leveled out and mined out anyway so it doesn't probably doesn't actually matter where the um, uh, excavator goes, to be honest with you, because wherever it goes, it's going to be refilled in anyway at some point. Um, it might sit on the edge of the map somewhere, just mine away at the edge of the map and not worry about it. So, uh, yeah. Um, so, how much is the excavator? Because we need that first. It's 2,000. So, we need to save 2,000 sites. So, we need to save some sites. So, um, yeah. Yeah, we need to save some sites. So, we get some stuff going on here. I've messed this up. I have messed this up. Right, let's pause two of you guys. I didn't wait for this. So I got distracted by stuff. I got. I didn't do. Yep. Yeah, yep. Yeah, I know. I know. I know. Let's prioritise these by the haulers to make sure they've all got. Um... I don't know. I know. I messed it all up. It's fine. It's fine. We'll pause two of those. We'll drop our beaver population back down again slightly. Um, that's fine. Uh, I could put more pumps in over here. It's not an issue at all. Um, No, don't need that anymore. Um, I'm gonna leave these on the edge of the map for the time being, just so I remember. I'll see them. But what's? Oh yeah, uh, what's that? Oh yeah. You're gonna build. You've got the gears. You've got the metal blocks. You just don't have the planks. Yeah, that's the problem. So. Let's 
Let's put in some more pumps, shall we? Do, do, do. He's going. Priority workplace. Just so we can get some more water in now, whilst we have stuff going on. Um, then these will get built eventually. Um, oh, you run out of gears as well, so we need gears as well. Enable the gear workshop. So yeah, I'll leave this running for a bit. We'll leave this running for a bit and we'll come back next time and we will carry on from there. So we have explosives. This has been finally built. Awesome, so we have explosives being dumped into there, that's cool. Uh, you're going to do metal blocks, which goes into there. You have got scrap metal, that's fine. We could unpause at least one or two of these guys and get you going. I don't need a ten here now, that's fine. That can be deleted, it's no longer required, so that can have resources come back from that one. Um, we need to unlock an excavator, which means we need to get more science, that's fine. All my science I've set to default, haven't I, which is... No, that's all right. That's all right, that's not a problem. So you're both full of extract and you're not going anywhere with the extract anymore. It's fine. So bad water. And yeah, the food is dropping. Yep. Yep. Okay, so we'll pause these two. We're gonna we're gonna have um a brief time of uh no beavers having any food. But that's okay. So there we go. There we go. I have paused them. Hurrah! Um, so we'll go down the food a little bit here. Uh, I could plant more crops over here as well and get some more crops coming in. Uh, what other crops do we have? Um, soya beans. And the problem is that a lot of the food we need requires like um, if we get more hydroponic gardens. Get more mushroom going. That wouldn't be a terrible thing. I put the wood on top of the wrong place, didn't I? Yes, I did. Yes, I did. Okay, so let's move the wood and let's build more hydroponic gardens and, and we'll do it. But anyway, we'll come back next episode. We will carry on from there. Um, I will swap these around um, and we'll put more hydroponic gardens on top of that one instead. Because uh, I'm an idiot and built the wrong thing. So, oops. Would you output and would you output? And uh, we'll come back and carry on from there. Thank you very much for watching. I hope you have enjoyed this one and I hope to see you again in the next one. And until then, as always, have fun.